Are you suffering from an unresponsive matrix UI? None of the things appear to be working no matter where you click. The Rhino interface appears to be working fine. The command line appears to be working fine, but nothing else on the screen is working. How do you fix it? Well, users in the matrix group on Facebook have reported that if you disable the internet, start up your program, uh, everything should be working fine. This leads me to believe that there's a communication happening between the matrix executable file once the program is running with the outside world. GemVision no longer supports Matrix 9, so therefore there should be no reason for Matrix to be communicating using your internet. So what we're going to do is enable a firewall rule that will prevent Matrix from communicating with the outside. This seems to resolve the issue. Let's go do that now. In Windows 11, what you're going to want to do is click on your start menu and type in firewall and select Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security. Um, there's an advanced firewall in Windows 10 and probably other previous versions of Windows as well. Um, I don't have those Windows versions, so you'll have to discover on how to do it for your specific Windows installation. <clears throat> what you're going to want to do is create an outbound rule uh, to prevent the application from calling outside of your computer. So click on Outbound Rules in the left-hand column. And here's going to be a list of uh, outbound rules that your system already has set up. We don't need to know any of that. All you want to do from here is go on the right-hand side and click on New Rule. Here we're going to select um, the program type, which is already selected here. And then click Next, because we're going to want to block the Matrix 9 application. So we need to specify that it's a program. Click on Next. Then we're going to browse to the location of where Matrix is installed on your computer. This is usually in um, on your system drive under Program Files x86, matrix 9, scroll down until you find the matrix 90.exe file, and select open. Click on next. We want to block the connection. I'd leave all of these enabled. Give your rule a name, the description if you want. Click on finish and that's it. Now, what we're going to want to do is shut down Matrix. You can do so by going to your task tray, right-clicking on the Matrix icon, kill all Matrix processes. Of course, this is if your Matrix file was already running and you can't close it because the UI is not responding. Now let's run it again. I tried to reinstall Matrix to try to resolve this issue. It didn't work. Um, I tried to block, I also added firewall rules for the Rhino files, uh, the matrix startup file, and also the matrix update uh, file that, are, that matrix uses when it's starting up. None of those worked. The only thing that worked was blocking the matrix 90.exe file. Now we see that the Rhino UI is working, the command line is still working, and uh, now the UI should be responsive. Um, play around with it, and everything should be working. Let's import a file. Let's open this one. 
It's fine. Let's try adding a new project. It's fine. And there you go. All right. Good luck, guys. Uh, if you have any problems with this, uh, leave a comment. I'll see if I can help you out some other way. Thank you.